aja kok Gak usah maju Welcome to Philippines Hi everyone Welcome to our channel of Philippine Adventures with Dan and Rochelle We are in Cebu We just uh, got my beautiful wife is approved to go to Canada with Sarah so, so happy. it's awesome. It only took us uh, less than uh, five and a half months to get ours, which we were told it would take over a year, which is pretty amazing. We were surprised it's that quick. So we're just now, it's been sent off to Manila and just to come back and then that's it. Mm. Mm. That's your food, baby. Amazing, amazing food. Why well, you call that this? I can't remember. Beef, uh, beef capiani. Oh, okay. Mm. We found this place. It's called Shabu Way. Shabu Way. Shabu Way. That's awesome. The food is really good here. And that's my wife digging in. Oh man, I got a, like a, I don't know, hot, sort of like a hot pot is sizzling on a plate full of uh, vegetables, but it looks yummy and hers is delicious. Anyways, what's that place called? Uh, Poo, Poo? Shabu Way. Shabu Way at the mall here, the main mall in uh, Cebu is amazing. It's raining here in Cebu. Cebu. We're some rain. Lots of rain. Finally, with the rainy season, I hope it comes every day. Anyway, so we're gonna get on the bus and we're gonna head all the way back to New Guinea, which takes about seven hours to go 150 kilometers or so. It's quite yeah. adventure. See you guys tomorrow in Dumaguete. Again, oh, yeah, there's a guy that uh, just cuts us right off. That's how they drive here right in front of this big bus. Uh, this guy here, he's kind of the, he's a ticket collector and as you can see, he's punching a whole bunch every time a ticket. I guess there are different times and stops. It's all manual. Um, anyway, it's, it's, it's interesting, but it makes his job a little hard. He's gotta do that for every single person that's on the bus, I guess. He pulls it and then he separates it. Uh, anyway, that's kind of how get on a bus and uh, from Cebu and how much did it cost us babe? 372 pesos each and then we stop at a ferry and uh, we're gonna pay another whatever 20 pesos 120 to get on the ferry um, anyway as you can see this guy's got a lot of work to do separating all those and taking receipts but anyway, we will check back once we get a little bit further down the road. Here's one of the guys trying to sell water through the window of the bus. And lots more outside. They sell everything. Churros. construction workers here uh, working very hard it's very manual labor everything's done by hand here they twist all the rebar um, labor is very cheap here in the Philippines so people have to work quite hard this is the city of Karkar um, this is kind of what it looks like in some of the this is a town about 45 to an hour, I guess, out of Cebu. Uh, it's just kind of how it is here. Little trucks. Uh, some big potholes and flooding. Uh, seems like they're always working here. Anyways, it's... Uh, yeah, lots of fun. There's an old armored car. There's a little mall. There's a McDonald's. All the people.
people here just uh, living their life.